Welcome to Old Friends Blog Visit 20. This is Beth. On tours, we often get asked, do you have any descendants of Secretariat on the farm? Oh yes, we do. This is the first of three videos highlighting our current residents on the Georgetown farm who descend from Secretariat. Closest kin to the 1973 Triple Crown winner is longtime resident Reva Way. Reva is a son of Tenor's Way, the last son of Secretariat and one of the very best. Tenor's Way won the 1994 and 1995 Pacific Classic among his grade ones. He resided at Old Friends from 2010 until his passing in 2017. Reva didn't inherit that much of his dad and his grandpa's talent. He was a hard-working little racehorse and did his best, and he retired to Old Friends in January of 2005. He's not our oldest horse, but I believe he is our longest time resident. The 2010 Breeders' Cup Marathon winner, El Dauphur, did inherit a lot of his dad, A.P. Indy's, talent. A.P. Indy was by Seattle Slough out of Secretariat's daughter, Weekend Surprise. A.P. Indy won the 1992 Belmont and Breeders' Cup Classic. He was 1992 Horse of the Year, a major sire of our time. Weekend Surprise, an amazing horse in her own right, was a grade one winner and 1992 Broodmare of the Year. She was also the mom of Summer Squall and Honor Grades. Secretariat's daughter Terlingua, a considerable racehorse in her own right, was the mom of Stormcat, the most breed-shaping sire of our time. He contributed speed and fire. One of his best sons was Giant's Causeway. Giant's Causeway had so many top racehorse progeny that I can't begin to name them all, but the last great one was 2019 Horse of the Year Bricks and Mortar. Giant's Causeway also sired Bunker's Edge, a little horse who needed a home. Another son of Stormcats, Hennessy, was the sire of Johannesburg, international two-year-old champion, whose mom was Biogaijin, by the way. Johannesburg sired Johannes Bourbon, a talented horse who just didn't have good knees. So Johannes Bourbon is a great, great, great grandson of Secretariat. Secretariat's grandson Stormcat also sired Bluegrass Cat, who sired Big Blue Nation. Big Blue Nation ought to be special to Secretariat fans. On his dad's side, he's descended twice from Secretariat, and on his mom's side, once. His dad is a grandson of both Stormcat and AP Indy. His mom is a granddaughter of a mare named Sister Dot, a daughter of Secretariat. Oddly enough, this horse named in honor of Wildcats fans hardly ever raced in Kentucky, but he's graded stakes placed. Handsome Ireland's Eye also has multiple descent from Secretariat through Stormcat's grandson, Cowtown Cat, and he also traces back to Secretariat through Secretariat's daughter, Rosa Mundi, a chestnut whose name means Rose of the World. Her mom was Lissadell, little W.B. Yates reference in there for those of you who love Ireland. Ireland's Eye was a claiming horse who did his racing on the New York circuit.
Here we are back with the herd in Area 51 again. It's time to look at Chirano. Chirano is the son of Grand Slam. His dad was gone west. His mom was secret to me. His dad was secretariat. Leader of the herd. So Chirano is a great-great-grandson of Secretariat. He also happens to be double cousins with Johannes Bourbon through Ogaijin, but that's a whole other thing. Here we come, carrots! There we go! But wait a minute though, wild horses don't get carrots, do they? So, Secretariat's daughter, Stormcat's mom, Terlingua, she had another influential son, a horse named Pioneer, who was the dad of our Dan the Bluegrass Man and the Cappuccino Kid. Happy was not the greatest of racehorses. He came to Old Friends in 2008, thanks to the hard work of Tim Ford. And purely coincidentally, Ogaijin's grandson, Brilliant Decision, happens to be a descendant of Secretariat through his dad, Bellamy Road. Bellamy Road is a grandson of the superlative racehorse Chief's Crown, who was a grandson of Secretariat. So if I've got my generations right, Brilliant Decision is a great, 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 great grandson of Secretariat. So thank you for going down Pedigree Geek Lane with me. And I hope also memory lane for some of you who remember these great children and grandchildren of Secretariat. More of our residents have Secretariat for an ancestor. A future video will feature them. For now, take care and see you next time.